and welcome to my channel. <laughs> Sounds so weird to say. My name is Sydney and I am filming my first ever YouTube video right now and I'm very nervous and very awkward <laughs> but I'm so excited. I've been wanting to start a channel for a long time. Um, I love thrifting, I love DIYs, I love home decor and those are things that I really enjoy watching on YouTube and I want to share um, my creativity and the things that I find thrifting with you guys. So, with all of that said, today's video I'm very excited about. It's my first ever thrift haul and I have watched millions of hours of thrift hauls on YouTube and it's just really fun to be getting to make one um, and share what I have found recently with you guys. So, this is a collection of things that I found um, within the past month. We've got clothing, we've got home decor, and we've got some shoes. So, I'm really excited and let's jump into it. Okay, so I'm going to start out with clothes because that is my favorite. Um, first up, we have these super cool vintage Gap high-waisted mom jeans. Um, they have the awesome little vintage tag back here. They are super high-waisted, baggy throughout the legs, but cinched at the waist, and 100% cotton. Just a really, really good find. I was so excited about. Um, they are not cropped. They hit like right below my ankle, so I haven't decided if I'm going to roll them or crop them, but um, you can see that in the try-on portion and let me know what you guys think. Yeah, they're just so great. These were $7.99 at Goodwill and such a score. This is such an amazing find. It's by the brand Lord and & Taylor and I'll post a little um, snapshot of what I find online, just kind of like a comparable piece or if I can find the piece itself online. Um, I know that this is worth a lot and I got it for $6.99. Um, it is so soft and luxurious and a really great basic for fall. Um, it's thin enough that you could wear it underneath a jacket, um, but also great for tucking in or wearing by itself. So I'm super, super excited to find this. It's in a size large, um, but it's nice and oversized, um, not too baggy or anything, and just a great find. Next up, we have, let's do this guy. Um, this is a beautiful 100% silk top top by Ellen Fisher. Um, I love this. Uh, first of all, it's $4.99 and I'm pretty sure it's online for like almost $200, which is crazy. Like I said, it's 100% silk and this color is so in right now, this pistachio color. Um, I've been seeing it everywhere and been seeing everyone thrifting for it because um, it's the it color of the season. So I was super excited to find this. I really like the brand. It's not Ellen Fisher. <laughs> Eileen Fisher? Sorry, Eileen. Um, anyways, it's kind of, it's not cropped, but it's definitely a shorter length, and so it's really perfect for tucking into high-waisted jeans, and I love it. Along the same lines, um, I found, this is probably my favorite piece that I have found lately. I'm really, really excited about it. Um, this, another 100% silk top, which is just beautiful. I love the print. I love that it's like not polka dots, but also not animal print necessarily. It's kind of like this in between. It's so, so pretty and it will go with so many things. I could see pairing this with a leather jacket, with a chunky sweater, with a denim jacket, um, even like over a white t-shirt. There's like so many ways to wear this and I'm so excited about it. Um, this, like I said, is 100% silk. It's from the brand Babaton, um, and I think I found it online, so I will put that up here, and I got this for $3.99. Next up, um, this is also just like a really amazing find that I was so excited about. It's so funny, I kind of just like saw this in passing as I was walking through the sweater section, and when you go thrifting enough, you just kind of are able to skim the rack and know what to grab um usually just by looking at the different fabrics so especially in the sweaters like i know what kind of knits i want i know that like the cashmere and this they're really tight knits and that usually means better quality so when i'm skimming the rack i'm skimming right over the really wide knits um because those are usually cheaper brands so skimmed through the rack found this grabbed it 
and knew the second I touched it that I would take it home. It is so soft. It's chunky. It's crew necked. I love the color. Definitely in my color palette for the season. Again, just so soft. It's going to be so great with like leggings, just cozy in the winter. But I can also see a lot of ways to dress it up as well. So perfect piece. So this top um, is by Vince. Um, and I didn't, I wasn't familiar with that brand. Um, a lot of times the like brands within stores, so like Nordstrom has a bunch of brands in it or, you know, Aritzia has a bunch of brands. I don't know them all by heart. So sometimes I'll pick something up. I know it's good quality because I can feel it, but I don't know exactly where it's from. So I knew this was good quality. It's a hundred percent wool. I don't know if I said that yet. And really funny that it's like, so so soft because every 100% wool thing I've ever touched is like scratchy and gross but this is not at all um anyway so I looked this up when I got home just because if I don't know the brand I typically do that just for fun and this sweater um and sweaters by this brand online are like $500 um I got this for six ninety nine, um so I was pretty shocked when I saw that um, really, really excited about this piece. Cannot wait to style it, and it's making me very okay with the fact that it's getting colder. Um, okay, let's move on to home. I just have a few home things. I am going to the thrift store a lot, and I'm finding home things a lot, um, so I'm excited to share those with you guys as I make more videos, but I just pulled like three of my latest finds that I really enjoyed off my shelf to show you guys. First is this really beautiful basket. I am a freak for baskets. I have baskets <laughs> like literally just sitting in this one spot. I can see five baskets. Like there's baskets all over my house. This is a great basket because it has a lid um, and it's perfect. We have built-in shelving in our living room um, that kind of takes a lot of effort and intention to fill up and fill up well so I'm constantly buying pieces for that I love this because it looks so pretty on the shelf um, just sitting but it's also functional because I can put things inside and hide them away um, this was $1.50 so great price and it's perfect condition like there is nothing no holes no nothing so love this the next thing I picked up is this pretty little jar. Um, I really love this amber color of glass and I have it throughout my house. I don't have any in my bathroom and so that's where I put this. Um, I love the lid. That's probably what drew me to it the most. Um, the fact that it comes with the lid. It's really, really pretty. I'm going to use this for like Q-tips or cotton balls. Um, and it'll go really great in my bathroom. This was $1.99. I'm pretty sure like 90% sure that I got this. It's a yellow tag and I got it for 50% off that day. So it was really a dollar. So cute. And then the last thing that I got, um, this is just like a glass candle holder that sits with inside this little wicker like basket holder thing. Um, I've just been seeing this type of decor all over. Um, I don't still have the price tag on this, but it was definitely like less than three dollars. Um, so yeah, super cool to find something so trendy and so in right now, but pay much, much less for it. And I just love the look of the glass and the wicker combined. It's really pretty. So. Okay, let's move on to shoes. That'll be our last little category. And I don't normally find shoes at the thrift store. I always look, but I'm pretty picky about what kind of shoes I like to wear and it's just really hard to find shoes that aren't like worn pretty badly and I'm not into that so I rarely ever buy shoes and this month I found like three pairs of shoes which is just crazy for me. Okay the first pair are these open toe mules. I love them, love them. Um, they're by Aerosols which I don't really know who that is. But um, yeah, they're these leather, they're so, so comfortable. The soles, probably because they're called air soles, are like memory foamy. They're, I mean, I could wear them all day long. They're very comfortable. So um, I wore them with the tag on in hopes of telling you how much they cost. 
and then the tagora. But they were either 10 or $12, I know that. Um, so incredible steal for a shoe that's very trendy and something that goes with so, so many of my outfits. Next are these. I, I love mules. Love, love, love mules. Um, these are Robe, R-O-H-B, Robe by Joyce Azuria. Um, I really like them. They're just simple, no heel really, black mule. Um, I'll wear the heck out of these. I have a camel pair that I got last year that I wore like constantly, so that's why I was kind of keeping my eye out for any mules at the thrift store this season because I just know I'll get a ton, a ton of wear out of them. So. Very excited about these. The last pair are these Steve Madden, um, what do you call these? Slides? They're like bands, but they're not bands. I don't know what you call them. Um, it's probably like an obvious name and I'm just forgetting it. But they're by Steve Madden. I really like them because they're a little bit chunkier of a sole than the bands. Um, not sure if you'll be able to see, but it's not just straight fabric. It's like kind of perforated a little bit like there's little tiny holes and it's kind of velvety i got these for ten dollars again these are just a shoe that i know i will wear constantly um i pair these with leggings and a denim jacket or high-waisted jeans and a sweater um i'm doing a ton of running around running errands picking kids up from school um that's what most of my week looks like so i definitely want comfortable kind of casual shoes for when I'm doing that so these are great for that reason thank you guys so much for watching um if you're new here which you all are because I'm new here too please subscribe to my channel I'm really excited about creating more content and just sharing my love for fashion and home decor and thrifting with you guys um, there will definitely be more to come so subscribe so you don't miss it um, give this video a thumbs up so that I can get a thumbs up for the first time ever. That would be so fun. Um, and yeah, I hope that you'll come back. I hope you enjoyed this video. Got some inspiration for things that you might want to go out and find. Um, and I'll also have links below my Instagram and my Poshmark and my yeah other social medias so that if you want to come get some daily outfit inspiration or see a little bit more into my life or even shop my closet, you can do that in the description box below. Um, all right, I think we did it guys. Video number one in the books. <laughs> Thanks for joining me, bye.